Good morning everyone. Uh, this is Patty of course and I'm going to make a really fast video on a beautiful soap and it is called Camel Girl. Like camouflaged? Yes. It's going to be Camel Girl. And I already got all my butters and all my oils and everything in here. I have ground oats in here and my kennel and clay. Give it a little buzz and see if we can get this thing going. The fragrance that I am using for it is Jovan Musk. Um, it is nature's garden and I had an ounce of Aztec's uh, pure seduction Victoria's Secret type and um, Glenn and I I was mixing and trying to mix and we said this is what it's gonna be it is just beautiful so let me get my lie this going here. Probably be a false trace because of all the butters. So we just keep that in mind. And away we go. Bring it up to emulsification. Then I'm going to put in the fragrance. tried the Aztec Pure Seduction, so hopefully it will behave itself. Alrighty, I'm going to get this completely in here. Cross your fingers. I guess I should put that on there because I'm having a hard time trying to get it off in there. I don't want another messy soaping adventure like yesterday. Boy, that was just terrible. Everybody was here and, you know, just that's the way it is with family, especially the men. <laughs> well, and the kiddos. Can't just say that. Oh, does it smell awesome. I've made this before. But, um, and it sells really, really fast. And I just haven't had time to make it again. But I didn't put the, um, Victoria's Secret... Uh, pure seduction from Aztec. Just gives it that little bit more of an umph oomph in it. And I hope everybody had a wonderful weekend. Glenn's getting ready to go out. So while he's messing around in the big truck, I am going to try to Get this made and into the mold. Okay, I'm gonna pour off. Oh, let's see. Okay. And this one it is going to be a creamy white in there too and just a little bit in there because that is going to be my um, activated charcoal so on this one here I am going to put a little bit 
of roast clay in here. And I love the mixture of these two. This is kind of like a neon pink. So I'll put that in there too. Uh-oh, I just messed up, didn't I? Yeah, I did. I just messed up, guys. Hmm. And I think I'm out of titanium dioxide. So, let me see. Yep, yeah, that was a pretty big mess up on my part. Let's just see how white this is going to be here. Feeling it is not going to be my pervy white. See, we all just mess up, don't we? Okay. Are you videoing? Yes. Huh? Yes. Yeah. I am. I'm going to sneak around back and get some tea. I <laughs> go right ahead. I think people would love to be able to see you. All right, let's try that. You could have went right there. They won't see your face, they just see your. Your legs and your your tummy. You know, they might like them. <laughs> That's for sure. They already like you. Because you like me. <laughs> and that still isn't too white. So did a big mess up. Are you ready to leave out? No, I'm so happy. Thanks, Stu. Okay. Good. And I'm just going to take my container, which now I have to. It's hot and reasonable. I bet. I thank you for putting in the air conditioners. Because that... Don't say that on the film. I already did. think I'm cruel? <laughs> no, you're not cruel. Okay. Yes. Let's see if that will work. Get some more titanium dioxide. Very well behaving fragrance. Mm -hmm. Yes, I'm your chew. Okay, this is going to have to do. We're going to have to have it. Not pretty white, but I just can't have it. I am completely out of titanium dioxide. So, yeah, that's going to have to do, folks. And then I will put the uh, Add a little bit more of this. Whoa. What? I look at your colors. Oh, you like them? They're pretty cool. Yeah, I think so. And, oops, this is gonna just have to be. This is just gonna have to be, folks. And here I thought I was going to get away with making a quick video, but it ain't so. And it's still okay. All right, activated charcoal. I wanted a gray, so let's see about that much first. I don't want it uh, black. And it's going to have to be just a little bit more. See, it's just not. Just not the gray I was looking for. Tater, are you just getting lonely because daddy's leaving? Huh? You hear that truck?
to the color. I think it's going to have to be a little bit more because it always lightens up after the saponification. So, we don't want a black black, but we do want gray. I don't know if you can hear the truck running outside. I know this thing picks up a lot of background noise. <laughs> Besides green, green is my favorite, but gray, I just love wearing gray and just, I don't know, maybe I'm just uh, more natural on the uh, colorants, but I love gray, always have, and you know, when Glenn met me, and of course we were both trucking many, many years ago, he was going one way and I was going the other. Um, I was the eastbound shuffler, and I mean back to back, I had just as many miles as when he would run westbound to California and back. And we met up, we're friends for a long time. I think I told you this before, but <laughs> do you know? After he didn't think he had hurt my feelings, he asked me, why do you always wear black? And I did. I was just kind of mourning life in a way, and I liked black, and I bought everything black. That's what I wore. Because, I don't know, I just like black, and it didn't show all the dirt all the time being out on the road. I never really noticed that I was picking out black, picking out black. And so being around him, you know me, I'm just not a glamour girl. He started picking out colors and made me stay away from blacks and grays. So he thought for a while. <laughs> yeah, I don't know why. You know, it really didn't dawn on me that like, I guess, uh, uh, Johnny Cash. I don't know why in the world. Oh, well. I guess the things that I was going through at the time, whatever. But it really didn't dawn on me. Nobody, not even my children. Of course, when I'd come in off the road, it'd only be for three days, and they would fight over who Mama was going to stay with. I don't think they even noticed it, but he did. He said, every bit of your clothing is black, and it was. So, I said, well, my second best color is gray. Nope, we're gonna do something about that. I said, okay. So he did, and that's the end of the story. Okay, that's just gonna have to be what it's gonna be, and I really wanted to make a third pink in there, but it's not going to be. So, folks, hillbillies at it again, that's for sure. I think after Glenn leaves, I'm going to take the kids down to Bloody Run so they can play in the water and run around in the woods.
always so sad when he leaves out. Even Jeremy when they leave out because I just start missing them terribly. For the top. Don't need that much. Let's get the pink. gray. And it's a beautiful gray. Okay. Let's do a smacker dacker and then we will do our squirrel. Should be a nice hard bar. Okay. Here we go. But first of all, I'm going to go like this up and down. Then Goodness, you stinking little hillbilly. You just cannot make a soap without having a mess. But yesterday was worse than today, so it's all right. Okay, let me get the rest of this without trying to make a mess. Still talking to yourself. Yep, I am. Okay. Sometimes that's the only thing that keeps me company. <laughs> it is. I've always talked to myself. But if I answer myself, they say that's pretty bad. Who knows? Ask me if I really care. No. Does it bother me? Not. So, I'm going to have to get an order in, get my titanium dioxide, and I forget what else I um, think dendrite salt. I don't know. Good thing I make a list. I'm a listy person. And Mm. 
No, I don't think I'm going to do it this way. I should have smacked her down a little bit more. So. You got that new fragrance. Yeah, the one that you and I did. Yep. Good job. Good job, Papa. Yeah, I think this is better. Just enough of a turn on the top. Give me a little bit more color. And let me give it a smack down. See if I want to do anything else to it. Yeah, why not? I just don't like heavy tops. Because they're very, very hard to... Okay. I'm going to spray the top with alcohol and then I'm going to put it to rest. And I'm going to try to get you up here. I should have took off my gloves. Can you see it? Okay. Don't want to make you dizzy. All right, everyone, hope you enjoyed the video, and we will be back to cut it. All right, talk to you later. Bye. Well, if I get this off. Good morning, Abby. Abby spent the night last night because we're going to be doing some soaking today. This is the top. Now, we are going to cut this. Let's see if I can cut it over here a little bit more. Miss Abby, do you want to do the honors? Yeah. Slowly, but not like molasses. You have to. Yeah. Very good. Ta da! All right, here's the end pieces. Let's go right in the middle. Yeah. Let me get this down a little bit and let's go right in the middle. This Whoa. is camouflaged girl. Like camo girl. Of course, they already know that because I'm just tagging this on the, on the thing. Oh, what do you think? Do you, do you like the pink and gray like your granny does? Mm -hmm. Huh? Airs out a little bit, it will smell even gooder. Oh. Hey, fly's gonna get in there. All right, everyone. Today, Abby and I are going to make two soap. She's gonna make one and she's gonna assist with the other. So. One's going to be a man's blue, what is it? Blue sugar. And I think Abby's going to do that one because the vanilla oak and French vanilla oak is going to be a little bit tricky because it does have a tendency to rice and I don't want you to feel that part where once you get used to what good behaving fragrance does. All right, can you say goodbye until later? Goodbye until And what later. else do you say? What do you say? You blessed day. Ask everyone or hope everyone has a what? Blessed day. Yeah, but you need to speak louder. Tell them, have a blessed day. Have a blessed day. She's not awake yet. All right. We'll see you later.